Hey guys, welcome back to Valhalla. Today I want to do a my best Valhalla build. This includes weapons, armor, and the way I play the game to destroy enemies entirely just like the best way I can, as quick as I can. Now everything in this build is acquirable really early on in the game, except for that of my actual weapon right over here, the Odin's Spear. But I've pretty much been using everything else in this build for the entirety of the game until I finished it. I'm at 81 hours played now, 82-ish or somewhere around there, and I literally, I'm unstoppable. Ever since I've had this armor, I've been unstoppable the whole entire game since like 15 hours in once I got this armor set right over here. And the biggest reason for this is this is a bear type set. So the, the armor I'm wearing is the Thane's armor set and it is a bear type set. I will show you all the stats and everything in a short while, but it is a full on bear set. All the weapons are the bear type. The spear is a bear weapon. The bow is a bear type weapon. And since my first style of playing this game was to go for all of the skills in the bear category and there's these certain skills that give you an increase to the damage and that the armor and all different set effects onto your gear provided it is the bear type or the raven type or the wolf type depending on what skills you picked so if you went full on bear early on the game and you had a bear outfit or a bear armor set and bear weapons those weapons were doing like like 20 percent more damage even 30 percent more damage than everything else that you have in your inventory which is <laughs> so broken by the way so before i actually had this odin spear which is actually godly the spear is just unstoppable the reach that it gives you just makes it so hard for enemies to actually get a touch on you so you hardly ever even need to heal or take damage because you can hit enemies from so far and you can hit them so quickly i've, I've actually equipped it on its own so my offhand is empty which means the spear is actually a lot faster because my character can use two hands to use the spear and it's a deadly speed for a deadly amount of damage and it's just it's just it's just really really good but early on in the game you can use something like varin's axe with the how House Carl X and those two X's in like just conjunction together is a really broken combo early on in the game and flails the bear flail is just nuts for bosses dude like something like that early on in the game is great this bow here is my favorite bow I've used it the whole entire time I think I've already made two videos on it this is the Scotty's Wrath bow and it's able to shoot five arrows at a time and really quickly without like a huge drawback so it's not like you're drawing the string and you gotta wait like two seconds for it to load you can literally just like shoot immediately all the time and this set Dude, this whole armor set is just... It's just crazy. It's just, it just sucks that by the time I actually got the spear, I was already done with, like, all of the members of the Order. I had finished the story, so there's no one really to kill. And my power level is quite high now, so all of the enemies I'm fighting are all green. Because, I mean, we're here in, I think, Gloucester Shire or something. <laughs> These enemies are supposed to be difficult, but they're actually really, really easy because, well... Just as you, as you progress in the game, you get stronger. I mean, as you can see, my power level is already 400. I've already put 30 points into bear mastery, which is the maximum you can put into one type of mastery. So, like, my character's pretty decked out. I've got, like, most of my abilities here all maxed out. I'm just finishing a few lost zones in the world to kind of collect all the different yellow and blue dots. So it's pretty crazy. So now let me show you my gear. So obviously I'm using the Thane's complete set. So Thane's armor piece over here. So it gives me two set bonuses, which increases my critical chance when I'm parrying. I parry a lot, so every time I parry and I rush in with my spear, I do like hectic crits that just delete enemies health bars. It also gives me an additional increase to critical damage, which is obviously, you know, like one in one. So the one feeds the other, the other feeds the other, so crits is a great idea for the set. This is the Scotty's Wrath Bow, which has an increased critical chance when hitting weak points. So that means if you're hitting weak points over and over, you're going to be doing crits pretty much all the time. I've also added a rune onto this, a specific one that increases critical chance when surrounded by more than three enemies. So if I'm like just shooting off at like wolves or something, I, I, I really tend to take them out nicely. So finally, for the spear that I'm using is Odin's Gun Gear, Gun Near Spear, however you say this. It has an extended reach by a force field, so you can hit really far. I've also so added a rune on here that increases the attack after each hit up to 10 times. So every time I hit someone with this fast ass spear, I'm going to be dealing more and more and more damage. And this build is just crazy for that. And I hope you guys enjoyed my build showcase here. If you do want to ask any questions about the build or something in particular in the game, feel free to comment down below. I do reply to every single comment. And I'll see you guys in a future video. Thank you so much for watching.